Okay, so day two of push-ups. Done a little bit of work today. Um, by a little bit of work, um, I'll just say that I've done band work. I did all-around workout for about 30, 30 minutes. Uh, I feel really flat. Eating too much food. Uh, the belly is uh, full. Anyway, um, I appreciate. I just want to say before I do it, I appreciate the support from a whole bunch of you guys uh, that talk about the start point. This is... It's an interesting start point. This foundation strength is something that you guys know I haven't been working on for the last uh, couple of years. It's all been the giant pumpkin, the specific stuff. So going to be focusing on the general foundation. I'm, I'm actually really excited to get home and train and just literally do nothing but foundation strength for a solid season. Um, <laughs> the push-up start point, as we saw, really bad. But... I expect it to come on quickly. Uh, the reason I say that, I used to be in the army. Um, I was a parachutist in the army where during that time, like to, to qualify on the parachute course, uh, you had to do 100 push-ups, continuous. Uh, you had to do 20 overgrass heaves, continuous. You had to do 100 sit-ups with your feet unheld, continuous. And you had to run 2.4 kilometers and I think it was under nine minutes. But anyway, so my, my body's got the memory of it. Um, I just haven't done it in a long time. And the range of motion in my shoulders, in my tricep, I, I, I get pain through my elbow in the tricep. I get pain in my shoulders. So there's a lot of uh, barriers straight away. But um, anyway, day two. Let's see how the push-ups go. I don't know. Look at the color of my head. Wow. Straight away. Whew. Felt better than yesterday. Felt way better. Uh, less shoulder pain, less elbow pain than yesterday. Uh, I went with more of a neutral grip. I don't know how my depth was. Um, but that was what, 20? That was 20. Foundation strength. Um, I'm genuinely excited to be doing it. And uh, I'm almost excited to take the Morozov path. I heard that Morozov only does arm wrestling once a month. And the rest of the time he's just in the gym being a badass. So that's the plan. Be a badass in the gym. And uh, arm wrestle once every now and then. Richard Lovke is, of course, the king of doing that. Um, I know I know how to arm wrestle. I know I'm conditioned to it. If I can get foundation strength, I think the reward will be fairly significant. Anyway, there you go, guys. Appreciate all the words of encouragement. Um, day two, done.